We take off. Maybe, just maybe, we'll get a clean start here, and maybe, just maybe, we'll see a wild finish to the end, which I think is already coming to bear, coming to fruit. Pardis and Garrett Smithley already bouncing off of one another before they get to turn one, Taylor. They certainly are. Here comes Anthony Alfredo with a head of steam. He's going to get tucked up behind Preston Pardis. Now he's up to the inside, going to take it three wide. No, thinks better of it. Decides to stay behind the 90 of Preston Pardis as Garrett Smithley now will take the race lead as they dive it into turn three. Smithley running the outside, tried to put the squeeze on Pardis. Pardis shoehorns his way to the inside. They nearly touch in turns three and four. Now they do touch in turns three and four. Crossover by Alfredo. He'll go three wide to the bottom. Alfredo made the move too early, coming out of two the last time by, and as they come to the white flag, Alfredo tied it perfectly out of four to get underneath the 90 and the 51 to potentially get the race lead. He bounces off the 90 on the inside. Here comes Smithley to the inside out of two for the last time. Here they go down the back straightaway for the final time. Preston Pardis with a head of steam, a couple of car lanes down as they dive it into turn three for the final time wide for that number two position and that's exactly what Preston Pardis wants to see because they cannot get organized to make a run at him for the lead. They're tangling in the back of the pack. Here they come off four, down to the stripe, checkered flag. Preston Pardis is going to take the victory. He wins it by just a car length as he fends off a three wide drag race per second on the final lap here at Michigan.